This is tutorial 2-2 and it picks up right where 2-1 left off. This is what you should have right here already. And what we're going to do in this tutorial is find out how to make group layers. And this is to help us keep organized when working on a map. Now the first thing we're going to be doing is right clicking on layers and adding a new group layer. And we're going to double click on it. Uh, either double click on it real quick or right click and go to properties. And then in the general tab we are going to name it population by county. And then in group we're going to add what shape files we want to be in that group. So we're just going to go down here and they want us to add US states and holding the control button we're going to hit counties. They've been added and then we click OK. As you can see counties popped up on top but we want US states on top so we're going to click on US states and drag it above counties. Then we're going to go into the symbol selector and we're going to change the fill to no color and the outline to black and we're going to change the width to 1.5 that way we can see the outline of the states and that way the counties don't look like they all blend together now we are going to go into the properties for count US counties and we are going to go to symbology tab and change change its graduated colors in the quantities option and we are going to be using POP 2007. Then we're going to click OK. And as you can see, it gives you population by county. And once that's done, they want you to close each of these little trees here by pressing the minus sign. And there's a your turn that you have to perform before moving on it's going to be used later in the tutorial and what we're going to do is we're going to turn off both of these and we are going to add a new layer a group layer and this one is going to be called population by census track Then in group, we are going to add the three shape files they want. They want the Nevada tracks, the Utah, and United States. We're going to click add, and then OK. As you can see, US states has appeared on top, so we don't have to move that. And we're going to do it just like we did with the other one. and we are going to change the symbology of this just like we did with the last one there take note that the numbers are different you'll learn out in a later tutorial how to change that to where they're the same and we're gonna close that tree right there now that we've done this, what we're going to do is learn how to save one of these groups as a layer. So we're going to be doing the population by county, so we're just going to right click on that. Go down to where it says save as layer file. And you're going to want to go to your exercises folder, go to 2, and save it in here. I've gone ahead and already saved it in here previously so once you do that you're done with uh, that part now there's another way of adding a layer there's two ways actually there you can go up to the add button and you can find it in your folder as you can see it's right there or you can find it in the catalog what you do is you go to your as repress folder go to my exercises chapter 2 and there it is you just click and hold and drop it now as you can see we have two of these now which we don't need 
So if you just right click on that, go down to remove, and you're done. And that's it for 2-2.